so as i was saying in my last video <coughs> excuse me i was going to talk about you know the role that governments can play in advancing the cause of agriculture in this country and specifically fruit farming and apple farming in particular um i'm speaking from a personal experience these are apples that are growing right in my backyard so the potentials that are there in these apples is not of any doubt to me and i'm talking as a first time experienced farmer and not someone who is just looking at it through the lens of anybody's camera or videos on youtube or every any other online platform so i can see the possibility that are here and i think that as people who are passionate about agriculture we can begin to form ourselves into groups and begin to see how we can approach government okay and if anyone is watching this and knows someone in government that you can share this with please do share how we can go to kenya get these fruits trees down to nigeria and begin to you know operationalize this in real commercial quantity you know there is indeed potential the apple market in nigeria is in hundreds of millions of us dollars every year and over a two three four years period you can this thing can run into billions of us dollar that is how much of our own local currency we are converting to dollars just to go and import these things things that can actually be planted right here and we can harvest and have fresh farm fresh fruits you know while still saving our nera and you know feeding ourselves and even possibly having some for export so this thought have really been going through my mind and i thought you know i should share it with fellow enthusiasts of apple farming like myself i am talking from an experience point of view having had these trees gone through you know all thick and thin with them and up till this stage i do know what it takes to take care of this and whilst i'm thinking you know a lot of ideas are coming to my mind as how possible we can go around because it's understandable that when you want to do this on a very large scale the cost can add up especially you know at the current rate at which the naira is losing value to the dollar anything that is denominated in dollar the price of that thing in naira tends keep increasing and we must have a way to circumvent that after all that is why we are farmers that is why we are agropreneurs we have to find a way to reduce our cost we have to find a way to circumvent you know very difficult situations and still get to profitability that is the hallmark of being an entrepreneur so a lot of ideas you know are coming through my mind and i'm trying to articulate them into you know some two or three major strategies which you know i want to share with people who have been following the channel perhaps some few people may want to key into those kind of strategies and together we can do something you know you know on a more serious level something you know that we can now begin to call commercial my experience with these things you should begin to get fruits within 18 to 20 at most by 24 months and of course depending on the number of trees you have you can begin to harvest tons of fruits even within your first harvest and we all know how much these things cost in the market but so you can easily do the maths i have done a video before about you know the pros pr profitability of apple farming business the apple farming business investment analysis in nigeria it's an old video now a lot of the assumptions there you know the naira has moved 
slided against the dollar so you may need to readjust those calculations but by and large the thesis is still uh, basically the same so these are real apples you know that i'm showing you from my own backyard farming it's not it's not image from somewhere in the on youtube or, or on the internet it's a real life recording of of uh, of apples and these are just the first fruiting of these apples so these things are not popular in our in our country uh, a lot of people believe that apple farming is for the whites for the for the western countries that it needs some very cold temperatures to grow so we have kind of resigned to just importing them but we are trying to dispel that myth dispel that myth and make people realize that this thing is possible and a lot of things are possible you know with uh, apple farming in this country these are just like some five or six trees i have in my backyard but imagine if these were hundreds of trees or thousands of trees and whatever it costs to manage them i already have a first-hand idea in terms of water and manure and other plant management strategies around so i'm putting together that strategic session and uh, hopefully i'll get another video where i'll present that strategy and possibly we can also do what i'll call an investor call where further information and clarification will be sought by whoever it would be investor and then we can see how we can make this thing bigger okay in nigeria here yeah. so until i come your way again with that video please stay glued to this channel subscribe if you have not already done so and uh, click the notification bell so that anytime i upload a video you will be the first to be notified uh these are beautiful fruits i'm liking them already even before they are done so until then stay blessed stay inspired and keep on farming